Hello, beautiful Gemini. Let's take a look at the energy in your love relationship right now, your love life. See what's going on for you. And so we're going to look at your partner. We're going to look at you separately, and then we're going to look at your outcome. So Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus of Gemini. Okay, Gemini. We're having a little bit of focus issue. Okay. So Gemini, right now, you're in a very, you know, you're in a kind of a lighthearted, detached mood. Your feeling is very much that, you know, you're just paying attention to what's going on around you. It's a little bit of the spy card. You're paying, you're scrutinizing what your person is doing, but you're not really drawing too many conclusions. We see the energy here, the three of earth, you're, you know, you really like being with this person. You feel as though they add a lot to your life. You may work with them with the three of coins, but it's a card of collaboration. So you really do enjoy their company. You, you hanging out with them is a very, um, very enjoyable aspect of your relationship. You have a lot to talk about. Seven of water. So the Seven of Water says that you're not completely satisfied. You would like more. You know, it shows that you're, you're keeping your options open. You feel like this is a relationship that maybe isn't grounded very well, that it's just more of a friendship. Seven of Water is still a very sensitive, emotional type relationship. You feel you have to be careful, though, what choices that you make and not to close yourself off in the relationship. The Ace of Fire, there's lots of passion here lots of uh, desire to make love. It looks like you're probably planning on seeing this person in the sometime in the next few days. I would say certainly within the next week. Your person's feelings about you, you they feel like you, you make them feel like the emperor. Wow. They really feel as though you're the one for them, Gemini. And I don't think that you know this. I don't think you even have a clue that this person sees you. And the eyes, you know, this is this is a, a very powerful energy. Your person sees you as majestic, as very good looking, as very somebody who's very powerful in their own lives. You're powerful in their life. So their opinion of you is extremely high. I feel very much they feel a passionate desire to have you as a as a family member, as a part of their pride. That's what that's what the Leo King is all about, you know, Leo the Lion. This person loves you. Look at that. They have their heart right there. A lot of fire. The person has a lot of fire in their heart for you. The Eight of Air, though, is oh, very telling. This person is not telling you anything. That self-imposed restriction, they feel as though they don't have the right. They feel restricted, like they can't come forward towards you. The Wheel of Fortune. Ooh, nice. It's interesting energy to see the Wheel of Fortune right here, Gemini, because what it says is that your person is waiting for outside circumstances to change. Given the fact that they feel so drawn to you, it looks like there's some sort of blockage they feel in the way of the relationship and that destiny and the wheel of destiny is going to have to turn, but they can't wait to see you. I get that. They're, they've been very busy. I feel as though the two of you communicate well, I do, but your person is like waiting for that lucky moment to sort of break away and come to you. The Five of Earth, the outcome card says that the Five of Earth is being left in the cold, feeling as though you're alone in this relationship and both of you are feeling this. I feel as though you miss each other. You fantasize about your lover, your lover absolutely has fire in their belly for you. We have patience card. You're both being very patient. This is this is temperance energy. You're very measured in this relationship. There's something about it that's of value to both of you. You look like you're you're a person that I feel like let me put it this way. I feel as though you're not nearly as invested in this as your person is Gemini. Your feelings about them and this energy update are very sort of scattered and diffuse. Both of you are being very logical about this relationship. You're using head over heart to discern, you know, what you're going to do with it. Look at this lover's card. The two of you are soulmates. Both of you know it too. I think Jim and I, you have really processed that this relationship doesn't have enough um, 
day-to-day -day activity, but you're definitely soulmates. Let's see what's going on here. Let's see why you're less invested than they are. Because your person looks like they're very invested in you and then they don't take action. So tell us, the, let's get, get a miniature reading on what that's about. Because both of you really miss each other. You both feel like you're locked out of each other's lives. But it looks like it's, it's understood. This relationship is understood by both of you. That you're very measured. The Libra Queen could indicate that, that one of you has a tie or serious relationship responsibilities to someone else. I, I feel, Gemini, that it wouldn't be you that would be in this energy. It would be the person that you're, you're with, your love interests, the Sun card. Look at that. The two of you are together for pure happiness. That's what we get here. I don't, neither of you can deny this relationship and the happiness that comes with it. The Page of Water, a really tender-hearted love relationship, almost childlike. A childlike sense of joy when you're together, a childlike sense of love and tenderness for each other and the queen of earth you both nurture each other you both really take care of each other from a standpoint of feeling like you can rely on each other emotionally so let's see what the <laughs> wisdom of the oracle has for you here gemini so you're very you know the two of you are at peace it just looks as though circumstances are not allowing the two of you to feel very grounded but the love is very powerful and it will remain that way from what i can see that sun card a chain <gasps> woo gemini a change is in the wind Ooh, wheel of fortune that's change i have goose pimples i just got radical <laughs> radical goose pimples reading this happy happy something's going to happen you don't see it coming let's see what sacred destiny says is going to happen and see if we can get some information here destiny is stepping in Oops. okay let's see what is the destiny of this relationship what is the destiny your person's clearly waiting for something there's a flow of energy so life ebbs and flows, right? The ocean ebbs and flows. There may be something to do with a full moon coming up here in your relationship. Gateway. Oh my gosh. There's going to be an opportunity for the two of you to come together that you don't see. There is a portal opening up. That's amazing. Go with the flow. Portal is opening. You're doing exactly the right things in this relationship. Gemini, that's what I have for you for your status update. Thank you so much for joining me. Sending you love from Chicago. Send some back and tell me where you're from. I would love to know.